Hi guys, Toby here for TP23 Productions. Now, got a film review. It's a film uh, that I watched a couple of days ago. Uh, it's one of my all-time favourite films. It's also the first film that I ever, ever went to see at the cinema. It was the film that scared me first. Um, I can't remember how old, how old I was, I don't think I was very old at all. And uh, that film in question is Jurassic Park. Got it in a trilogy, so there's my trilogy box set. You're going to see this about three times. However, the film in question that I'm first going to do a review about is the first original film. It came out in 1993. Now, like I've said, it came out in 1993. Jurassic Park is a film based around the idea of one guy. A guy called John Hammond, uh, he is the sole founder of a bioengineering company called InGen. Uh, InGen have decided to take DNA from mosquitoes that they have found, uh, that they have dug up from around the world, and uh, they've decided to play God, to create dinosaurs and put them on an island. This island is called Isla Nubar, uh, that is site A, just off the coast of Costa Rica, and like I said, he wants to build his own theme park. A theme park that is surrounded by dinosaurs. Now, being a fan of dinosaurs, I think this is an amazing idea. Um, I think that's probably what attracted me to the film back in 1993. However, John Hammond needs the approval by certain people. Uh, one of them being Sam Neill, who is Dr. Alan Grant. Ellie Sattler, who is his love interest in the film. She's also a paleontologist. A mathematician of a genius that is Jeff Goldblum who plays Dr. Ian Malcolm. You've also got a cameo, um, kind of a big cameo from Samuel L. Jackson who plays Ray Arnold. Uh, that's probably the first film that I've ever seen Samuel L. Jackson in, which was um, at the time I didn't know about. However, Samuel L. Jackson, who is a kick-ass uh, actor, uh, pretty cool to see him in one of my favourite all-time films. So, like I've said, Jurassic Park is the brainchild of John Hammond. And he needs them people to give the green light, to give the approval for this island to be created, really. For them to uh, say that it's okay to have dinosaurs running around in pens and closures on an island for people to come and visit. So that's the main reason behind the story. However, um, one guy called Dennis Nedry decides to be a bit of a greedy SOB take all the DNA samples of the dinosaurs and uh, try and make his own money off the back of the company he works for. A uh, bit of a stupid choice, he decides to shut down all of the electrical grid and all the power to all the park that are keeping all the dinosaurs in their pens and that is when the proverbial brown stuff hits the proverbial fan. That's when it gets interesting, all the dinosaurs come out to play, uh, T-Rex is on the loose, Velociraptors are on the loose they're the two main sort of stars throughout the film. Really, it's a aim to survive. The, the humans, they've got to survive, um, try and get off the island, kind of call for help, dodge all the uh, T-Rex and the Velociraptors that are out to uh, eat them, really. There aren't many dinosaurs throughout the whole film. You see uh, Brachiosaurus, obviously the T-Rex, Velociraptors, uh, you see a Triceratops. Uh, Dilophosaurus as well. Um, they're really about the only sort of dinosaurs you see, which is a bit of a shame, really. You know, more, more. You know, you want to see more of them. Um, however, on a whole, I may be a bit biased toward this film. It is great. I do recommend it if you're a dinosaur fan. It's one of my all-time favourite films. It's also the first film that I ever saw. Um, I do remember seeing it at the cinema and when the T-Rex got out of his pen I did actually shit myself as a young child and run behind the seat my dad was sat in in the cinema um, so I do fondly remember that um, but Jurassic Park 1993 if you're a fan of dinosaurs any of the actors that I've mentioned including the dinosaur actors um, then I do recommend it for you so guys, thanks for watching my review of Jurassic Park, the very first film. I uh, hope you enjoy it, thanks for watching. Also, We The Devoted, links down below as per usual. Use TobyWTD, gets you 20% off any We The Devoted items you decide to purchase. Links are down below. But guys, thank you very much for watching my review of uh, Jurassic Park, the original first film back in 1993. Hope you enjoy it. Thanks for watching.